guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a spring clothing slash accessory slash shoe haul. Some clothes to show you guys, some accessories I picked up, and I believe there are two pairs of shoes that I picked up also. So like I said, uh, this is a spring, I guess you could call it a spring clothing haul, I don't know, whatever. But anyway, I did not purchase all these things in the same day, they were different days that I purchased them. Um, and I think, I believe it's one, two, three, like four different places I think that I purchased these things from. So, uh, I figured I would do a video and show you guys what I bought. Okay, so let's get started. Start with is some of the things that I purchased from Rue 21. I don't know if you guys are familiar with this store or not. Um, I'm pretty sure everybody has one of these in their mall. <laughs> but they actually had like a really big sale going on. So I purchased a couple of these things. I have, I have a pair of shoes from little booties. Um, they're like tan, I guess, or nude, whatever you want to call it. And they have the little buckle right here. They're wedged boots. Um, but I just thought they would be really, really cute. They're, they would look really, really good with, um, you know, like skinny jeans or maybe like a little dress or a skirt of some sort. But I just thought they were really, really cute. And they're like the nude tan, so you can pretty much wear it with anything you want. These are in a size small, but I believe they were like $10 or something like that. Because they had a lot of their stuff, like buy one, get one for $10. Purchased this really cute statement necklace. They, have so, they actually had some really, really cute statement necklaces. This is what it looks like, if you guys can see that. But I just thought that was really, really cute. I love statement necklaces. You know, I love to dress them up or dress them down. Uh, like, you know, just with like a basic shirt. Um, you know, you can really do so many things with statement necklaces. But I really, really liked this one. I don't know if you guys can see it, but let me show you up close so you can see like we're underneath my hand more like isn't that pretty I just thought it was really really pretty I like the colors in it um kind of like a black and like a nude kind of so it's kind of like a neutral so you can pretty much like dress it up or dress it down and wear it with anything so I got that one and I believe this one was $12.99 and I got let's see I just got I, my, my lips were actually really really chapped while I was uh, shopping in there so I ended up just picking up one of those EOS um, lip balms and this is the one uh, the green one and this one's sweet mint so I haven't even opened it yet I know but that was the only reason why I really bought it but I love anything mint so little headband things on sale so I got two of them so I got this one which I thought was really really cute I don't know if you guys can see it or not let me see if you can. it's kind of like I guess they're like leaves I guess um, but yeah so it's just a it's like a regular headband, like I can just put it on and show you guys if you want. Yeah, I just thought it was cute. I thought it would look really good with my red and my hair. This was, uh, would be really, really cute like to wear your hair down with, or even if you wore it up like in a bun or like anything like that. Is more of like a, I guess like a cloth kind of headband, or I don't know what you, what these things are called, but I just thought it was cute. It's like black and um, it's got like the, the rhinestone things on it. I don't know if you guys can see that but I just thought that was really really cute and it's got like the stretchy part in the back um but yeah I just thought that would be like really really cute like in your hair just to you know have it like a different look a different hairstyle um and this one was $6.99 and I got it uh 50% off so not bad for that and then I got a pair of sunglasses which I thought were really really cute I've seen a lot of people wearing this shape sunglasses so when I saw them I was like oh my gosh I love these but they're really really cute they're um they're like gold and then I'll show you guys I put them on I just thought they were really really cute I thought they would look really really good I love any kind of big sunglasses so when I saw these I definitely liked them and I really really like the shape of these they're different I don't really think I have a pair like this or own a pair that look like this so I'm glad I picked these up um let me see so I'm not sure how much I paid for those because I don't have this bag on them okay so I believe that's it from forever I mean not forever 21 rue 21 <laughs> let's go on to the next shoes I got and I got these from the store traffic not sure if you guys are 
familiar with it or not, but it is a shoe place. They're um they're pretty affordable, I feel like, with their things. But I was actually I wanted to get a pair of black heels, but I wanted a pair that were um like had fringe on them because I feel like I've seen like everybody with those and. I don't know if they're just like in style right now or what, but I just, I saw these and thought they were so cute. So I ended up getting them and they look like this from the side. So they have like, and I really like it because it has the gold zipper in the back that you can, you know, you can zip down and then you put them on like that. Um, but this is the heel. You guys can see the heel. And then it has the fringe, which I thought was really, really cute. And they are open toe, so they're kind of like the peep toe. Um, but I just thought they were really, really cute. I think they would look really, really cute with like a pair of jeans or leggings, uh, skirts, you know, anything really. I mean, you can really just wear these with anything, but I thought they were really, really cute. I really like the zipper detail. And then, of course, like all the fringe. Um, I'm really getting, I've never been, really been into the fringe, but I'm actually into it, and I really, really like these. Uh, Forever 21, I got a couple of things, just a couple of things from Forever 21. I ended up getting another pair of sunglasses. I just thought they were really, really cute. I have a, two other pair that are like this, but different colors. Like, I believe one's like a pink and orange, and then the other one's um, like a light pink, green, and blue. Like, I don't know, they're just different. But I saw these and really, really liked them. They're like purple and blue, and they were only... And you guys can see that tag, $3. So I was like, yeah, that's cheap. I love sunglasses, but I'll try these on for you guys. You know, I got all the, still got all the tags on them. But I just thought they were really, really cute. They're aviators. Um, I love avi aviators. They are my favorite sunglasses to wear uh, style. But, yeah, I really, really like these. I really like the blue and the green. I needed a new little like cosmetic bag or a new lipstick bag to put in my purse um, and I just saw this and it was like $6.90 I think and it's cream and it's just like a little bag just like a little cosmetic bag I just picked that up from Forever 21 I thought that was cute like the color of it and then it's kind of got like the rose gold like zipper on it which I thought was really cute too so like I said I just needed like a little cosmetic bag for like my lipsticks um, or my makeup that I wanted to like roll I picked up two anyway. dresses so I picked up this from the basic <laughs> so I ended up just going with the black one of course um, but it looks like this and then it's just one of the long dresses but it's like fitted um, but yeah I just thought that was really really cute this one was $9.90 like a lot of I love all their basics a lot of their basics are very affordable, like very, very cheap. So I saw this dress and they did have it in other colors. I actually wanted a lighter color for spring since we're like coming up on spring now, but they actually didn't really have anything. They had a like a cream cut. It was like really, really see-through and I just couldn't do it. I just thought that was really, really cute. I like, I love everything from their basics. So yeah, it's just one of those long dresses, but it's like perfect for spring because that one and then I got this one which I really really like. I don't have anything like this. Shaped, and this one was $17.90 but so it's shaped like that in the front you guys can see that like the dress and this is the pattern so it's like a flower pattern but it's just black and white um, and it's long it's like one of those long kind of like I guess you could say like a maxi dress kind of because it's like long like a maxi dress but uh, this is obviously different because of the way I don't have anything owned like this, so I just thought this was really really cute. So I also from the basics section, and this it was only seven ninety, and it is a black pencil skirt. So I just thought that was really really cute, and it's, I like the material. It's like a, I guess like cotton, so it's like soft. I just thought that was really really cute. I love. Love, love, love. Guys, is line. from this store, which is called Love Culture. I know about this one either. They're only six ninety five, so I figured I'd get them. But they're just like you know regular basic tees. I got a black one and I got a gray one, but I'm not sure where the gray one is. Um, so you know, it's just like a regular basic tee. It's like flowy. Um, it's like a little bit shorter in the front, kind of, and then longer in the back. So, I, just, I like that. I thought they were really, really cute. I like, you know, just regular basic tees like that, like, just to wear, like, around the house. And, and it's so funny because I was, like, debating on whether or not to get these because I spent, 
like sixteen or seventeen dollars on these and when I thought about it I was like I could probably could have done these myself at home with a pair of regular leggings but I just thought they were really really cute and I like the way that they looked on me the slits and you guys can see it but they had the slits like and they go pretty much all the way down to the bottom but I just really really liked these I thought they were really like the little rips and stuff and I'm, I'm like obsessed with the whole rip jeans and rip leggings and you know all that look but yeah I just thought these were really really cute I got this too I don't know if it's really considered spring <clears throat> excuse me guys but I thought it was cute uh, comfortable and just like to wear around the house but it's just like this gray cut a long sleeve it's gray and then like half of the sleeves are black right here uh, and it's like really I really really like the material the material is really really soft and then I just liked this little detail it had on it. It has like this little zipper right on the shoulder. So, I'll show you, yeah. So, you guys, you can unzip it and then zip it up, you know, like wear it off the shoulder. But I just thought that was really, really cute just to lounge around in. I thought it was a cute top. And I paid, I know, I paid $18 for this. Like, what am I thinking? I have another, uh, another pencil skirt. And this one is from the Love Culture that I'm showing you guys. I paid only $7.95 for this. So they kind of, I feel like they kind of have similar things in, um, like Forever 21, but in like, you know, like in the basics or whatever. But it's a gray and white one. You guys can see that. I just thought that was really, really cute. And like I said, it's the, this is like the cotton too, but it's a pencil skirt. But I just thought that was really, really cute. And I feel like that would be really like nice and comfy to wear, you know. I don't know what I'm going to wear, but... And then this is the last thing I purchased from Love Culture. I really, really wanted a black blazer. I don't have, I actually don't own any blazers, which is weird. One online. I actually do own a red one, but I just purchased that one this year to wear for Valentine's Day. So I wanted a black one. I kind of feel like everybody should have blazers just because you can dress an outfit up or down with them. It's like a little chilly out, you know, you just throw the blazer on and it keeps you warm. But I just really, really wanted to get one and I wanted a black one. So when I was in Love Culture, I found this one and this one was on sale, which was good because I found another one and it was like $20 some dollars and I really didn't want to pay that for it. So when I saw this one on the clearance rack, I got this one for eleven. you guys can see that, eleven ninety nine. So I was happy about that and I liked the way it looked. So yeah. I ended up getting this black blazer. I thought it was really, really cute. I liked the detail of um, on the front of it and everything. But yeah, so I'm glad I found that one and got it on sale. And then I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the store called Ross. I'm sure you guys have. But it's more of like an affordable kind of... Um, it's kind of like a Burlington, I guess you could say. Um, or even like a Marshalls, uh, TJ Maxx, things like that. I feel like it's similar to that. So I picked up a couple of things from there and I wanted to show you guys what I got. These I absolutely love. And these are like a light washed pair of jeans. So this is what they look like. And I just had to get them because they had all of like the like the rips, like I told you guys, like I'm obsessed with. So they go down and then they're just like folded at the bottom so you can wear them as like capris or skinny jeans but I prefer them rolled up I just feel like they look better um, but I just think that these would look so so cute with like even maybe like those tan little booties that I got from Rue 21 um, or anything like I said you know you can dress these up or down if you want but I just thought these were really really cute and I got these from Ross and I believe these were Mm, I'm gonna say like 20 maybe or of light light wash I really really like those very like really light wash jeans I actually don't own anything like them and then I purchased there and this was only $8.99 you guys have got to go to Ross if you've never been there because they have some really good deals on things like you can really find a lot of things in there I purchased like a lot of clothes from there and I always have people asking me like oh where'd you get this where'd you get that from like Ross <laughs> So anyway, so I found this one, and this is just like a gray dress. It's long sleeve, but it's like really, really light material, so it would be nice to wear like in the springtime. It's very light, and it's got like, that's what that looks like, and then, you know, it's just a dress or whatever. So 
And then it's, um, I actually really, really like it too because it has, see this, let me show you. Like on the sides, it kind of has like these little slits on the side. But it's kind of like a t-shirt kind of. But I don't know, I just thought it was really, really cute. And it like fits really, really good. Like it fits like tight. Not tight, but you know guys know what I mean. Like, so it shows your curves. <laughs> so I thought that was really, really cute. And then, I don't know what it is, but I'm like obsessed with these pencil skirts. I don't know what my deal is, but I'm like constantly buying them. So when I saw this one, I'm like, I ha I just had to have it. You know what I mean? So you guys know I love leopard. Like leopard's my absolute favorite. So when I saw this and I saw it in a pencil skirt, I was like, um, yes. But I really, really like this. I was actually upset because I went and tried it on in a medium and the medium was like a little too snug to title me. Because, like, I, I don't know if I told you guys or not, but I gained a little bit of weight um, when I uh, when I got out of a relationship. So, it wasn't a very good time for me, but I ended up gaining some weight. Um, so, the medium didn't fit, but I actually had gone back. I think I had gone back to, like, return something or exchange something, and I ended up looking again. And large, so I was so excited, and I went in the dressing room and tried one immediately, and I was like, yes, because it's, like, fit perfect, like... It still, like, was fitted, so, like, you can see, like, my curves and everything, but it wasn't, like, super, super skin tight like the other one. So, I was so happy I found that one. I just love this. I just thought it was so cute. The thing I have to show you is a, another blazer. Like I said, you know, I didn't really own any blazers, and I wanted to pretty much have, like, some neutral colors. So, like I said, I went with that black one, and then I found this cream one. It's more of, like, a... I guess it's kind of white, but it's kind of like a cream, so it's like a mix. I found this one, and I really, really liked it, and I really liked the detail on the sleeves. It's kind of like, um, I guess you could call it like ruching, maybe? It's fitted, and you know, I just, I love the way it looked on me, and it was like stretchy. It wasn't like real, real tight or anything. I like the material. Guys, I think that's it for this video. Uh, make sure you guys give me a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe, as always, so you don't miss out on any of my videos. If you have any video suggestions, please leave them in the comments down below. And I will be happy to look at those. Uh, so with spring coming up, I would love to do some spring makeup uh, tutorial looks for you guys. So if you guys are interested in that, let me know down below. And I will be sure to do that. But I think that is it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Like, let's see. Okay, so this says, treat yourself to the sweet scent of sugared peony petals atop swirls of rich vanilla buttercream, which, you know me, and I'm not a big fan of vanilla. I hate the smell of vanilla, but I actually don't smell vanilla in this, so I don't know. I mean, it smells really, really good. Though.